Hey, what up, Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're doing good. Welcome to my AC Valhalla uh, review video. So in this video, we're going to review the Draco bow, which is the mystical hunter bow, and I'm going to be buying it using my Opal from Rita's shop. And this is taking place on the first of December, 2020. As far as I understand, Rita's shop resets all the time, and if you don't buy it t uh, today, for instance, you can buy it some other time. So let's stop wasting time and jump right into it. And by the way, just a heads up, in case if you're not buying this bow for Opal, you can still buy it for the Helix credits. But I would recommend to grind those Opals, save them up, and buy them when it pops next time at Rita's shop. So let's go ahead and review the actual weapon. Alright, so come to Papa. This is going to be my first Everything mystical weapon, by the way. There you go. Nice. Finally, I have I a good see you one. later, friend. Because <laughs> I'm doing let's plays on very hard difficulty, and it becomes a little bit a pain <laughs> to deal with everything, man. So, it's a hunting bow. Uh, that use hunter arrows, right? Should be the case. Hunter bow, hunter bow. Yeah, hunter bow. So there we go. Let's apply it and upgrade it to its maximum, and see how much damage. Oh, I will not be able to upgrade to its maximum because it requires that material over there, which I ran out. <laughs> what is that material? Titanium. Great, I need to farm more of this stuff. But okay, I did not know that because I'm still going with the flow uh, with my last place. So this is the bow. I managed to get it to attack 102. So that is pretty insane. Compared to my current bow, which does 69. <laughs> All right. So the looks, the looks are good. Oh, hold on. There we go. That's the bow. Boom. Not bad. Actually, it looks really nice with that hidden blade, all the golden style. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> all right. Cool. By the way, since I purchased it now, this is still available at the store. I'm just super curious. Should be gone. Because I bought the map pack, uh, the complete map pack. I'm going to make a video on that too. If, But I'm not sure if I'm going to recommend it. Okay, yeah, it's gone. It should be in the own section. Of <clears throat> section, I hope. Yeah, there we go. Oh, we can't. I can view it in the other, like the option when I used to do the rotations. Well, that that sort of sucks. Next time, if I'll be getting something for Opal, I'm gonna show you from all the sites from the store before we actually get in here. Okay, let's go to the inventory once again and see what else does this boat got to offer. So, uh, we can put some more rune slots in there and uh, increases rain damage behavior you are. What is that supposed to mean? <laughs> I'm gonna have to check it out at some point. Alright, so runes. Uh huh. So I don't have these type of runes yet. Oh, that, that kind of sucks. So I can put any of these types, but not this type because I guess I haven't still yet to unlock anything. What should I put with this bow? I think more attack would be nice. Still got a lot to do with the unlocking stuff. Headshot damage, critical damage. Ability damage. Stealth. Oh well. <clears throat> Is there another way to spectate this? Oops. Wrong button. Oh, there we go. 
So yeah, the balls look really nice. From 0 to 100 weight. Bonus 3.0 to 15 ranged damage. Uh-huh. So the weight... Okay, got it. Increases range damage the heavier you are. Okay, so I need heavy weapons. Something heavy, heavy, heavy. So if I go back and go to <coughs> my stats. My heavy is 107 right now. Okay. Got it. So maybe I should do uh, the heavy dual wielder. In that case, I'll have more heavy weapons in my arms, right? Because right now I have daggers, and they weigh eight. If I, for instance, were to have, uh, which is a, a two-hander. Ah, uh, there you go, two-hander. Weight 15. <clears throat> so now it makes a little bit more sense in uh, getting this dual-wielding skill. I think it's right here. Yeah, heavy dual wielder. In that case, I'll have two super heavy weapons and find myself a heavy armor set. So basically, it should increase my damage with this hunter bow because I'm going to be heavy. Increase range damage the heavier you are. There you go. That makes sense now. Zero to a hundred. Oh wait, but I'm already a hundred, so I should be doing. Uh... Mhm. Mm and my weight. Where is the weight? There you go, 107. So I'm um, should be already good. But anyway, I'll do a few tests uh, once I get all the everything components and do a separate video on the bow. But this is just to show you the looks of it. And it looks nice. I like the gun stuff. <laughs> so if I were, for example, to remove my hood over there, that's how the bow looks like on the character. Alright. Well, this is where I'm going to be calling it the end for this video, so I hope you enjoyed it and uh, hope you found it useful. Um, and I hope it will give you a better decision whether to buy this bow or not for Opal or credits, whichever comes for you. Uh, those who already own the bow, maybe you can drop some comments down below if you're enjoying it and how it goes. So it'll be really nice to find out. Boom. I got the power skill, so that's cool. There we go. Look at this baby. Yep. Well, anyway, this is where we're going to be calling in the end for this video. So I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, you know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody see them, nobody can read them, nobody can react to them. So if you got something positive or negative to say, feel free to drop the comments. Just don't swear. Simple as that. And if you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z Client. I'm Gamer Z, sold from Ukraine, so hi from Ukraine. Once again, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to join our Discord, feel free to do so. Uh, the link is down in the video description, as long, along with any other useful links that you may find of use, such as my Twitch channel, uh, tutorial on how to use our Discord, etc. So once again, thanks all for watching. You all have a good one. And uh, I'll catch you on the next video. Bye. From the ashes we rose